So, I'm actually gonna paint these. I'm gonna take them down, put them in the garage and prepare and paint it. I've talked a bit that I will, will have this in wood. As it turns out, it's quite hard if you don't have the proper tools to cut this and not to hurt them in the process. And what I mean with hurt them is the saw is shipping away a little bit here and there when you cut these pieces so it doesn't look that great. So the only way to overcome that is actually to use putty, sand it down and then paint it. This is gonna take a little bit of time because this has to dry and uh, my coffee stomach really rumbles so I think I'm gonna go in and feed it with a cup of coffee and hopefully I can continue this when that is, that is done so yeah let's do that Fail. That's a really, really interesting blue. I think that will go really well to the base that's gonna be white and to the ceiling that's actually black. I, I this is really interesting. Okay, so we are gonna finish off this painting and we are going to do this side because this side is done. It's actually finished with the gas struts and everything and it turned out really good. So I'm pleased. We have also painted this wall here and this one and then we're gonna paint this and it's gonna be painted one more time after that and then it's gonna be finished in this side of the van 
Then we're gonna have to paint everything from here and forward because that I haven't touched. So this van is actually taking form and it's very exciting because as for now, it's not that much more to do before I can go and get this van in inspected. And that's a big step because when I get this inspected, this is gonna be classified as an RV. And that's amazing because it's gonna be lower insurance cost and the biggest and the best and the greatest thing of all. I can drive it on the way. <laughs> Let's do some painting! <laughs> so one of the th fun things with this is... Painting is actually one of the things that I hate. <laughs> when it comes to anything, building, making or anything like that, it's fine. But painting, I have always hated painting. I don't know why, because it's satisfied when it's done really satisfied because paint can change so much but when it comes to take the pencil and the paint bucket and just paint it's so freaking boring another thing that i realized yesterday i have not told you my name in any of my videos maybe the first one but if i am gonna be real how many are gonna go back and watch my first video yeah let me introduce myself. My name is Mats. I'm living in Sweden. I'm 32. I just, I actually just turned 32 a couple of days ago. So congrats on me. I sold my house 200 square meters because I felt I need change. A real change because I've been stuck in life for a really, really long time. And that got me really sick. So when I get better, I just made a plunge and, and, and bought myself a van, sold my old house. And here I am. And sometimes I, I, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I don't really know what I'm doing, but it's going to be fun. Life is yet another story and you are the one writing it. Hello. It still smells pain. Yeah. It's okay, it will be fine. Yeah, it will be fine. happy with that it's not perfect but it's it's on place and it looks good so, yeah. can it be better yeah but uh, do I want to care no I just want to be done at this point point. and for you who have built and converted these vans you know what I mean at the start it's really fun but at one point you just want to get it done and get the hell out to explore yeah, and I'm at that stage, so yeah. It's not perfect up here, but yeah, I don't really care. So, yeah.